I just wanted to let you know we're getting ready to process chickens, but all I'm going to do here is show you my setup. Um, this is how we do it. Uh, the old farmer built a table and put cones in it. That's where he dispatches the chickens. Then we dip them in this, my turkey pot, it's back. We dip them in there. You got to do that to break the feathers loose and you put it in scalding water. I think it's about 160, 170 degrees. And here's that uh, whiz bang chicken plucker I told you about that my husband built. Um, he got everything, had everything, excuse me, um, here on the farm with the exception of these rubber fingers and the metal base and the rest he, he built. Um, he by no means invented this. I mean, there's a lot of these out on the internet, but this works the best for the numbers that we use to process. And then I'll show you a chicken going through it later, but the feathers then deposit down into that old laundry basket. Then once he gets it, all the feathers off, then he lays it on this table and that's where I do the processing. Uh, today all I'm going to do is chunk it up and clean it up as fast as I can so I don't think this is going to take very long we just have a few to do. I sanitize all my equipment, uh, scrub it down with uh, dish soap and then I bleach everything. So um, the yucky bucket is for the yucky parts and the clean buckets are what I'll put the chicken pieces in. The stainless steel bowls um, are what gizzards, hearts, and liver goes in. So for any of you that like chicken gizzards, chicken livers, yes, they, they don't make them in the grocery store. They, go, they come from a chicken, a real chicken. And I wanted to show you this because, guys, don't go buying your wives one of these for Christmas. I don't think too many wives would be happy. But several years ago, this is what the old farmer got me for Christmas, was a butchering kit, and I was thrilled to have it. Um, it just comes out whenever we process our meat. So anyway, um, we don't have, we have a large kennel that we will put the chickens in. See Remy, she's out there waiting for a ride in the gator. Um, I'm getting ready to go out to the chicken coop and get the old hens. I'll still keep my young laying hens. And I don't know, maybe 10. We're not going to do very many this morning and it's not going to take very long. This afternoon I'm going to can and make broth and chicken soup. That'll take several days to do all of that, as, um, probably. Anyway, next video will be the one probably most of you aren't going to want to watch.